Hollywood Studios, based in Harapia's port in the Northwest Province, has set a new standard in South African film. It's built the first solid set in the country in the form of a little 1950s town called Pretville. This town is the home of the New Afrikaans musical feature film with the same name. There's so many aspects to this film uh, in terms of producing it. The one aspect is building the set. Um, it, it has given people the opportunity, um, job creation for a good year and a half to physically build this whole town. And then the art department that was involved for a good six months, dressing every single shop. It, all the signs have been hand painted. Um, the music that has been scored, over 30 songs, we had to get mu musicians playing real saxophones, real trumpets. Um, the wardrobe department that has worked on this film, clothes, costumes that has to be designed, makeup. And in some days we had over 180 people on set that had to be fed. So it is a massive project for a small South African company. Pretville is a fully functional town with a town hall, a diner and other shops that will be open to the public in November 2012. The town hall will be turned into a movie theatre, allowing the public to watch the movie where it was shot and have a bite to eat in the diner. This is a 1950s musical not being seen ever in South Africa the way we have shot it, designed it, produced it and translated it. I think for South African films it's very important that one needs to support them. It uh, doesn't matter if it's a Kosa, Zulu, Twana, English, Afrikaans film. It is very important for the public to support our local films. If the local films don't get the support, the producers won't make the films. It's as simple as that, which means the talent will not grow. So I think one needs to support any locally produced film. And the, the, the good thing about Pretville is that it's being subtitled. So there is absolutely no excuse. Pretville opens in theatres on the 23rd of November 2012. Matsidi Somadia, EWN, Harapia Sport. Eyewitness News. In touch, in tune and independent. For the latest, log on to ewn.co.za or ewn.mobi.